There once was an 85 plus by 3 A Medina Foot Fantasy SBC But don't let that distract you from the fact that the USA is going to Qatar Oh, when the upgrade comes Oh, you're at the bottom side, like, now we're having fun Oh, when the upgrade comes I'm gonna break everything in my studio. What's up, boys, and welcome to the 30 times 85 plus by 3 pack opening episode here featuring a Vafankuda Medina SPC that looks pretty decent. 180,000 coins is not cheap by any means, uh, but he is a guy that I think gets a minimum of plus 2, probably goes up to an 89 rated card, which means he's looking at around probably like an 89 or 90 pace split. Some people are complaining about the fact that the pace split is not OP uh, because he's got the 80 acceleration, 92 sprint speed, as is with a Shadow Chem style. He goes up to 90 acceleration with 99 sprint speed. I don't know what more you could ask for. 81 stamina, you could make an argument. A little bit meh, but 90 defending, 91 uh, standing tackle, 88 slide tackle, 87 aggression, then 90 strength with that 86 reactions and the 92 sprint speed with a nice little bit of short passing. I think this is a decent card. Two stars, two, uh, two, star, two stars in L, uh, but he does uh, get those green links in the Klaus as well as the Fofana. So in my opinion, I think it's a cool card. Uh, dynamic pick, um, has a tattoo on his neck. Uh, Argentinian, so if you do run like an Argentina squad or whatever, I guess you can get a little bit creative with him. Uh, but uh, in my opinion, looks like a pretty decent card. 180,000 coins. I think it probably should be maybe in the 145, 150th, 50-ish uh, uh, um, uh, price range. But maybe we're just uh, splitting hairs there. So I don't know. Maybe you guys let me know. Bounce it out to you guys. Do you guys like the Vafacundo uh, Medina? Some people might not like him because he's not like super, super meta. But I would make the argument, what is not meta about him, right? He's got some ridiculous sprint speed, 92 sprint speed, uh, and... Uh, um, in my opinion, looks like a pretty good, looks like a pretty decent little card there. Even has the 80, uh, 82 ball control. So uh, that is a uh, piece of content number one for the day. Uh, and then we also have ourselves this 85 plus triple upgrade coming in around 40,000 coins. You get three players that are 85 or higher. Uh, there are still the Fantasy Foot Days players in packs right now. Are these packs worth doing? I wouldn't necessarily say that these are the most worthwhile packs, but for those of us that might have some 83s and 84s, requires, I think, an inform as well as an 84 rated squad. It might give you an opportunity to get some high rated fodder that you've submitted into some SPCs recently. So it's not cheap, uh, but it's not like crazy, crazy expensive as well. Um, so uh, I might eat maybe one or both of them on the RTG. Who are we kidding? I'm a DJ and I'm going to do both of them. But smash like on the epi if you guys got something good in your 85 plus triple upgrade pack. Smash like on the epi if you guys got something trash. Smash like on epi if you think your country's going to win the World Cup. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. But without any further ado, boys, pack number one, Alice. All right, so he did the 85 plus rare player three pack two times. I'm going to predict an 88. I'm going to predict an 88, an 86, and an 85. Paul Pogba. All right, Pogs. All right, uh, an 87 Paul Pogba at this stage in the game, guys, is what? Yeah, I mean, like, this. that's that's just not it. I think, okay. Um, Courtois, 89 or 90, whatever, 89. 89, 87, 87. I mean, that's not bad, dude. It's 47K. Courtois himself is like 30, so you came away with some profit on that one. Yeah, these are just, I don't know, De Den Denmark, who could that, is that, no shot, that's an 85. Three 85s. Do fantasy foot players act, e exist? I'm gonna break everything in my studio. German, Cruz, do <laughs> oh. All right, these have been quite stinky to begin with. We've done four already. These have not exactly been at 80, oh God. Say it with me, boys, on the count of three. I love it. But so far, these are just strictly fodder packs, man. That haven't really been paying out. I don't even know if fantasy foot players exist in this. Do you absolutely love it? Really so much fun. No, not Chiellini. No shot. Not, not Bonucci. Okay. Um. Still, uh, I don't know. What are we saying about that? I mean, Rodrigo's guaranteed to go up to a 90 rated card. Rodrigo's guaranteed to go up to a 90. If, it, if the SPC is 40K, that's a dub right there. Rodrigo himself is 42K. Oh my God. <laughs> Wait, Thomas, wait. I'm gonna break everything in my studio. Royce? German? Ha! <laughs> That's class! There's gonna be an Oyarthabal, right? You can just feel when a player's in a pack. But if you hit on a couple 88s, couple 80, you know, maybe an 89 or something like that. I mean, what's going on here? England? Harry Kane? Sterling? Sterling's what, 25, 30k? So he's already got about uh, two-thirds of the uh, pack value back if he hits an 87. Sterling, Zhao Cancelo. Uh, again, I don't know. Maybe close to breaking even. Not 100% sure. So far, only one fantasy foot day player in him. Inform. Argentina. Dima. 
All right, an 89 Di Maria. That's actually not too bad. Uh, surely he's more than 30. Surely he's more than 30K. An 89 Angel, uh, Angelito Di Maria. He's 42K, so he's the price of the SPC. You just got back profit from that. Maybe an 88? Maybe like a sick regular card? All right, so you make profit from that. That's a dub. All right, let's rip the pack. He's got 175K. We've only gotten one Fantasy Foot Days player from this. If it's an inform, we need a big... Suarecito? All right, so an 88 Suarecito. I think an 88 Suarez right now is 25K, which is kind of crazy. Luis Suarez is 88 rated card. He's 25K on the dot. All right, so we need another we need another 20K worth of value for this SPC to be worth it. Are we going to get it? An 88, 86 Varan, and then a Busquets? I don't know, man. Uh, who knows? There could be a game-changing fantasy foot player here. You never know, bro. Um, Ronaldo? <sighs> Bruno Fernandes. So Diaz in the last set. Bruno Fernandes, a Manchester United supporters. Uh, I believe Bruno Fernandes uh, extended his contract to 2027, if I'm not mistaken. These suck. Yeah, they're not Smexy, right? These are not Smexy packs, man. But I think we knew that going in, dude. I think we, uh, I, th I think we knew that, uh, I think we knew that going in, dude. These are not Smexy, dude. 88 Bruno Fernandes goes for 25k. Wojnia Szczesny is going for, what is it? S S C Z. Uh, he is going for 16k. So you come close to kind of breaking even on that pack. But it's just not exciting, man. You want like a, you know, you want to, you want, you want to, you want a live card. You want a fantasy foot. Let's see, fa hey, fantasy foot player right here. We've only had one fantasy foot days player. We've opened up something like ten or twelve of these already. Plenty of informs. Right mid, Otavio. Maybe we talked about Angelito Di Maria being the key to Argentina's success. Otavio may be the key, and this actually doesn't look like a half bad card to be fair, dude. Eighty-six Otavio. Hold on a second, man. Four star, three star. Go to dribbling stats, to be fair. That's a, yo, that's a nice little card. That, that's a nice little card. That's actually a nice little card, to be fair, dude. And then at 86, Marez and Ayoris. Let's get him a, uh, let's get him a, let's get him an Alvarez. Let's give him a Foot Fantasy Days Alvarez, man. He's got him in the concepts, which means that it's going to pop out. Who is that? Hey, let's freaking go, dude. Come on! Rolando, no, my name's Harry Kane. Tesco! That's a 90 Harry Kane, man. Maybe, uh, you know what? I'm going to say, here's here's what I'm going to predict. Because I know Pax so well, I'm going to say it's going to be a 90 Harry Kane. Smelling his own farts. Uh, it's going to be a 90 Harry Kane. Uh, and then I think behind it, there's going to be an 87 Thomas Muller and then an 85 David Silva. Watch this. Watch this. Whip that. <laughs> okay. Close. 86 and 85. All right. He gets another walkout. It is going to be Frange. P.O. Box. Spurs? Uh, Hugo Lloris. All right, cool. Um, a cheeky Hugo Lloris. A uh, Hugo... Hugo... Hey! Yo, in terms of... Uh, in terms of packs, I think... Uh, yo, Georgie's packs have been pretty decent, man. That 90? Yo, that's legitimately... That's actually not that bad, man. What is that? I don't know, Chef! It's not good enough! The man spends literally every waking hour making embarrassing memes of Zwenyel. So let's see what kind of luck that brings his account. Is it going to be an Annalise? Uh, Dutch. Is that Bergwijn? Steven Bergwijn. I'm going to say this. I'm going to say 89 Benzema or an 80, uh, 89 Benzema or 88 uh, Suarezito in this pack. Behind the 85 Bergwijn. Not. Okay. It's getting serious now. 85 Bergwijn. All, all informs, I believe, are 25K. He does get another walkout. No, no shot. No shot! <laughs> Dude, come on, bro. No, man. That's not, bro, come on, man. That's just, he's, Ronaldo's 35K, but I mean, like, bro, like, Grells can't keep getting away with it. It's like, did you take a bagel? Crack an egg in it and then put coconut around it and then put it into a bag for to take away to to take away to your lunch. Is that a Lego? Is that? A... Let's get an 89 rated inform with an 87 and maybe an 86. We don't want any fives in this. We don't want any 85s in it. Come on, EA. Okay, walk out. Uh, Neuer, uh, Ter Stegen, 90. You take that. Keep doing that. You take a 90 Ter Stegen, right? You're not gonna get you're not gonna get like an account changing pack here, but you're gonna get a little bit of fodder. 
So maybe 90, maybe an 88, maybe a Bruno Fernandes. Hey! Hey, not bad. That's not bad. I'll take that. Yeah. Yo, you know this picture was this picture was taken almost this was this picture was from 2014, 2015. Why do I why does my hair look like that? He's got himself uh he's got himself a prime icon pack as well, dude. Yo, uh, Haber, you want us to do the, uh, you want us to do the Prime Icon pack as well? Douglas? Oh. Wait, isn't he in team? Oh, no, that's Tyranny. My bad. No, I thought, I thought. Hey, as far as 85 by 3 packs go, that's actually not half bad, you know? As far as, as far as 85 uh, by 3 packs go, that's actually not half bad, dude. Tradable, uh, Andy Robertson. Andy Robertson. Get the hell in, lad. Let's see if we can pack himself. If we get Ken Kenny Daglish in the Prime Icon pack, I'll do 10 gifters to the chat. And I don't know why I'm sounding Irish. This is more of an Irish accent than it is Scottish. How does it feel living in Florida? I love it. Yo! Prime Cafu? Yo, a 93 Carlos Alberto from the Prime pack? That's decent, you know. All right, 85 plus rare player three pack. Uh, is that Katie, Kevin De Bruyne? Hey, let's go, bro. Keep doing that. I'll take a 91. Uh, I'll take a 91 uh, Manchester City Kevin De Bruyne. Faraz would be very happy with that pack. Faraz Dino. Do not even. No, 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 no. Keep doing that. Dude, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Yo, that is a. Yo, what's up, man? Isn't Tottenham just a factory in London that creates bottles? Inform. Di Maria. Hey, Analito Di Maria. Vamos. Vamos, tío. Um, reading, uh, reading FC are massive. I'm going to predict a 90 plus rated behind him. Okay. 89 Di Maria goes for 45k. Gianluigi Donnarumma goes for about 35-40k. And then a Sirugu, who I believe that's like a relegation side. I think that's Genoa. That's a decent little pack, man. 85 plus rare player uh, three pack. Um. Uh. Yo, dude. Dude. Look at that, yo, that's crazy, dude. Na Wait, hold on, Neymar Cito? Hold on, who, who else is behind it? If there's a fantasy foot days player behind this, I'll give this, I'll give five subs. Oh, thank God. Thank the gods. By the way, guys, for the first time in four years, Belgium is not the number one ranked, uh, for the first time in four years, Belgium is not the number one ranked uh, country in the world. Brazil is. And I stand by this prediction. I think Brazil is going to win the World Cup.